Back on Kodiak Island, Trooper Boyd Branch leaves the bears behind and heads into town. Kodiak is a small community, 95% of the community I've never met, and that's a good thing. But there's that group of people that we see on a daily basis. You know, whether they're the victim of a crime or the suspect in a crime, they are always having police contact. And today is no different. Fairbank 63, 1036. How you doing? Good. Hey, I'm Trooper Branch with the State Troopers. The reason I pulled you over is because your muffler's yeah, not I working at all. I actually just got this car. I can show you the bill of sale. I just picked okay. the damn thing up. Do you have insurance on the vehicle? I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I just picked the car up from where, it, where I bought it from. OK. Anything in the vehicle I need to know about, guns no, or drugs no, or? No. All right, well, hang tight, stay in the car. Yes. I'll be right back with you. Fairbank 63, 27, 29 times 3. I've stopped this guy a few times for normal traffic violations. I know that he runs with a crowd that's kind of into some drugs here in Kodiak, but I'm not sure that he has insurance right now. KPD warrants for failure to appear original charge, no liability insurance. 10 4. Okay, so I, I'm going to ask you one more time. Do you have insurance on the vehicle? I know I you said you just bought it. I just bought it, so no, okay. I don't. No. Have, you, have you ever had insurance issues in the past? No, I haven't. You've never been charged with no insurance or no, anything? Okay, so the fact that you have a warrant for no insurance from you. From me. Oh, no, from, from another guy. From KPD. Yeah. So you just said that you've never had an insurance issue in the past? I, I forgot about that one. Okay, hop out of the car for yes. me. Yes. OK, turn around for me. Put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest. All right, you have a warrant, and you also don't have insurance, OK? Again, I'm going to ask you anything I need to know about here in the car. No, sir. I don't got nothing on the guy. All right, well, we're going to check it out. Oh, that's one. That's one. But troopers spot a telltale sign. People with spoons like that and that's, the floorboard of their car, I mean, that's pretty indicative of drug use. That was under the seat. Under the seat? Yes, sir. OK. That might be what you're saying, but you also lied to me just a minute ago. 